Alright, finished up all that stuff, and now I am back at Iverstead, and I'm about to make my way up the 7,000 steps. Up to High Hrothgar to speak to the Greybeards. Should be able to get him before he gets to me. Come on. Going through his arm. Come on. Oof. Oh, hello, a trap. Oops. <laughs> well, that was an accident turned into hilarious. Now, where's that dragon? I don't think I've ever had a dragon show up on the way up to High Hrothgar before. Seems a little early for there to be a bunch of random dragons. Since... Spoiler alert! Alduin has not begun resurrecting them yet, since we're not that far in the main storyline. But then... There's a dragon right there! What the hell? There's only supposed to have been that one from the original... The first dragon that you see slash fight whatever at Whiterun. So it shouldn't really matter. So why is there a dragon? Hey, we're finally here. Oh, it took forever. And if you look to your left, you will notice that this is the location that I used for the 5,000 sweet rolls. Going down right there. Anywho, oh wait, I was supposed to drop off the supplies. There we go. I do believe I need to level up first. Let's get the health up to 200. Not yet. That one will be nice. So, I'll get that next level. But I need the prerequisites first. Alright. So, a dragonborn appears at this moment in the turning of the age. Yes, I am answering your summons. We will see if you truly have the gift. Show us, Dragonborn. Let us taste of your voice. Oof! How's that? Is that what you're looking for? I am Master Angil. I speak for... Now, tell me, Dragonborn. Why have you come here? I came here because I'm answering your summons. We are honored to welcome a Dragonborn to High Rothgar. We will do our best to teach you how to use your gift in fulfillment of your destiny. And what is my destiny? That is for you to discover. We can show you the way, but not your destination. Ah, uh, just like the Matrix, I can only show you the door. You're the one who has to walk through it. I'm ready to learn. You have shown that you are Dragonborn. You have the inborn gift. But... Do you have the discipline and temperament to follow the path laid out for you? Uh, that remains to be seen. So, next up. training, you have already taken the first steps towards projecting your voice into a thum, a shout. Now, let us see if you are willing and able to learn. Okay. When you shout, you speak in the language of dragons. Thus, your dragon blood gives you an inborn ability to learn words of power. All shouts are made up of three words of power. As you master each word, your shout will become progressively stronger. That makes sense. Master Einarth will now teach you Ro, the second word in unrelenting force. Ro means balance in the dragon tongue. 
combine it with fus force to focus your thumb more sharply. <laughs> Dragonborn, you can absorb a slain dragon's life force and knowledge directly. That's convenient. As part of your initiation, Master Einard will allow you to tap into his understanding of Rome. Thank you. All right, I'm ready when you are. your unrelenting force shout to strike the targets as they appear. Okay. Impressive. Your thumb is precise. Show great promise, Dragonborn. So I will now. perform your next trial in the courtyard. Follow Master Bori. Okay, now that we're here. See how you learn a completely new shout. Master Bori will teach you wood, which means whirlwind. Hear the word within yourself before you can project it into a thumb. Okay. Will it sprint? Just uh, open this. Ready. Master Wolfgar will demonstrate whirlwind sprint. Then it will be your turn. Master Lori. X. Wolf. Now it's your turn. Stand next to me. Master Bori will open the gate. Use your whirlwind sprint to pass through before it closes. I'm ready. Go. Well, that's convenient. Your quick mastery of a new thumb is uh, astonishing. I'd heard the stories of the abilities of Dragonborn, but to see it for myself. Um, so it's not easy, this easy for everyone? Also, thank you. What's next? You are now ready for your last trial. Retrieve the horn of Jürgen Windcaller, our founder, from his tomb in the ancient fane of Ostengraf. Remain true to the way of the voice. You will return. So there's only four of you? Five. Our leader, Parthenax, lives alone on the peak of the throat of the world. When your voice can open the path, you will know you are ready to speak to him. All right. Sky above, voice within. 